Will it? Will it? Smile, come on, you can do it. Well, we had no aces on Saturday, no one on 59 watch, but the drama was still high in the third round of the CIMB Classic as players tried to find that perfect balance between being aggressive on such a gettable course and playing it smart. This leaderboard is a volatile one, and with 18 holes of play, there's over half a dozen guys that could easily take home the victory. 18-hole leader Scott Piercy put himself back in the mix on Saturday when he holed his second shot for Eagle on the 14th. Will it? Will it? It will. That's how you do it right there. He then kept it rolling on 17. Nice putt right in the middle. He has really righted the ship nicely. Unfortunately, a double bogey on the last dropped him from 18 under to 16 under par, leaving him four off the lead. Justin Thomas, who was on 59 watch Friday, was cruising the majority of the day on Saturday, like this 20-footer for birdie on the 10th taking him to five under on his round. Now, that balance between aggressive and patient play affected him as well when he took three wood on the 16th right into the water. He was able to bounce back with back-to-back -back closing birdies to maintain a share of the lead at 20 under par. The yin and yang of this game continued with Spencer Levine. First, he eagled the third, converting a 10-foot putt, then dropped his 20-footer on the sixth. Beautifully done there. And just when it looked like he was ready to keep his foot on the gas pedal, this happened on 15. And that's how nasty it was. He didn't move it two inches. It resulted in a double bogey, and he finished at 17 under. One off the lead is Kevin Na, who chipped in on the 10th and route to a 19 under par score after 54 holes. And tied with Thomas is Brendan Steele, who held the lead at the Fries.com Open a few weeks ago and has given himself another chance this week, making 35-footers like this one on the 9th always works. As we all know, the game giveth and the game taketh away. All right, that'll do it from day three in Kuala Lumpur. I'll see you right back here after that final putt drops in Malaysia.